Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another NRL round reaction. Uh, we are in round 26, and we got one more after this, which is, yeah, once again, that's insane. We're just about at the end, almost at finals. It's going to be awesome to check that out. Um, yeah, so round 26, um, I didn't watch any of the games this week. I, I did get spoiled for the Cowboys Storm game. Um, I randomly, yeah, I, I, I got a perfect margin on that one, so I'm excited to see the highlights for that, because, yeah, I'm pretty proud of myself for that one. But yeah, the rest of the week, I have no idea what happened. Um, there's obviously crazy races at the top and bottom of the ladders right now. Like, the whole the whole thing is the wooden spoon. There is the eight, the eighth spot, and the top four is all still kind of jumbled up, too. So it's going to be really exciting to see what happens here. Hopefully, we get some more clarity, but if not, then the final week's just going to be an absolute, like, yeah, absolute banger week. So, uh, yeah, let's just hop into it. Uh, make sure to drop a sub, drop a like, comment your thoughts in the round. And, yeah, thanks for, I hit 3,000 subs a few days ago, so thanks a ton. Thanks for the support. It's been awesome. Um, yeah, let's hop into it. All right, guys. So, yeah, we'll go over my picks before each game like we always do, and then watch the highlights and check out the comments as well. Um, yeah, so obviously, like I said in the intro, I had Cowboys by eight, which I know the, uh, the Cowboys uh, won by eight, so that's awesome. But... Yeah, the Storm obviously had their, uh, pretty much their second team was playing, but, you know, let's just see what happened here. Interesting to see who is, like, if any of these Storm guys are any good, because they put up a good fight, I guess, so that's good. Munster was playing, okay. Fifth in our game, nice, nice. When you get the ball... In the hands of Cameron Munster, these things will happen. Yeah, well, yeah let me know how many players on the Storm the are gone. playing right now in the Storm that'll be on the team next year. They're going to save a bunch of, a bunch of young guys. Oh, there we go, 40-20. Nice, nice. I think he's got this. Oh, what a pass. There you go, Cowboys. Huge. Where are the Cowboys in the standings? They're like right on the outside of the top four, right? Like in the five to eight, five to seven range, I think. This is a huge year for them. Nice. They have the new young seven as well, right? On the, on the Cowboys. I don't think this ball hits the ground. Is it a double movement? No. Well, no try. The ball doesn't hit the ground. They're looking at a bobble. Alec McDonald maintains possession. Yeah, why is the ball to the goal line? We have a decision. Why is the commentator saying it didn't hit the ground? That was weird. Oh, what was that? Wish Wish was the guy that had a crazy week like a week or two ago, right? I believe. Something's missing. I don't know if it's a concentration thing. Like an example, there's been two tries tonight. Jeremiah and Nate. The first try to Big Lazarus. Yeah, didn't was Wishart the guy that had a hat trick like last week or the week before? The lack of I think. concentration. Steer clear of the front row. He was pretty time. nasty. And, and the Storm Panthers were actually. NRL yeah, and NRL W tells right. the Premiership Grand Finals on Huge now, kick. Oh, what a grab! Soars, and Drinkwater comes out the back of that contest. <laughs> NRL.com slash tickets Sunday October six at Core Stadium Sydney. <laughs> Melbourne hoping to be there. The Cowboys hoping to beat their vastly depleted opponents tonight, and they're going to get a try there you back. Go. Yeah, there you go, Cowboys. Good for the half. Dearden is going to switch the point of the attack. It goes to drink water. That was a great ball to Lange. Oh, back good to passing. Holmes, and it's a try for Bell. Nice, Holmes. 200. 200th game, yeah, nice. Great, nice. Play. great play. Running the ball in the last play. And they got to, to a Lange away. Yeah, great passing. Good finish. A set of defense on their line. Keegan Russell Smith Maroa slipping. Oh, he's got smoked in the head there. Oh, See, this is a tackle penalty. They're no way to say it. No hassles this time. They called that a high tackle? I gotta no, see that again. There's no way they called that a high tackle. That's crazy. Russell Smith Maroa A set of defense on their line. Keegan Russell Smith Maroa slipping. Okay, that that's insane. That should not be a penalty. If, if that's what the actual call was, a high tackle. I think the I think it was because the ref said I understand he slips. Like he had no, he, he didn't even he wasn't even a tackle position. He just like of defense on their line. Keegan Russell Smith Maroa. Yeah, I don't think that's a. You can't. I don't know. I guess you protect want to protect the head, but like, what are you supposed to do? The guy just like slipped and fell into him. And got him high. Like that's not. 
I don't know. That, that happened in hockey. They usually don't call that, apparently. If a guy changes his movement at the last second, they, they won't call it. Because um, it's not like the defender can't do anything in that situation. So, I don't know. I don't know. It's a good, it's a good debate to have, though, I guess. Anyways. Uh, do you understand he slips? Oh, so this is a tackle penalty. No hassles this time. Not that slushy, Joey. Munster. Huge kick. It's a tantalizing kick. Oh, we got contest. it. That was, yeah, was Bradley nice. making ground to the ball. Uh -oh, Stolen. Here. Keegan Russell Ooh, was, Smith thinks that it's was really interesting. Had to go through the hands. Why did he Dearden's kick that? Got it and races back past his 10 meter line. Can, can I see it again? Why did he? Was yeah, that pass not that wide open on the right here? Contest. That was uh, Bradley making ground to the ball. Why did? I guess they see the logic of him being able to run around there, but he, if he just passed it to him, he would have scored. Chance. Tantalizing kick, great contest. That was uh, Bradley making. Was it? Was this guy not gone like straight? Like maybe this guy would have caught him on like a diagonal run, but no. I feel like he had. There was a way better chance of scoring just via pass there. I guess that's is that one of the inexperienced guys from the newer young guys that, that must be why what happened there because that was a weird the ball. One. chance here. Keegan Russell Smith thinks it through to the end goal. He had to yeah, go through the hands. That was definitely a. Uh, Dearden's yeah. got it and races back past his 10 meter line. Yeah, well, all plays into my margin, so that's good. <laughs> oh, it's a spot. Oh! oh it. Wishart's going to score. Jeez, Wishart again. How many. Yeah, Wishart was the guy that had the tries and against he the has Panthers, a right? To level us at 24 all. Yeah. I think it was Wishart. Let me. I'll look after this game first, Wishart. Probably mixing ball ball it up with someone. Inside. There you go. Cowboys. And put it down. A drink water, McIntyre. This is Clifford. He'll kick out wide. Do the bounce. For a third what was he doing? Oh, Aramea couldn't what it was that guy doing? Okay, yeah, a lot of iffy plays by the Storm guys here, which makes sense, but the other guy had it and he just like whacked it from him. Messed him up. Oh, I was just going to say he's dropped it, but the ball is high out. tackle. Yeah. yeah, high contact. That's what I thought. Okay. There you go. Oh, Huge kick. Right All right, that's so there's the 38. So one, one more late try for the storm he's here. Got fresh legs in the Maybe another Patrick. Oh, who's that? Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's gone. Look at the speed. Oh, what a, what a dummy. What a play. What a play. That was sick. Two points in the bank. All right. And the Cowboys. Storm 38. Or Storm 30s. Cowboys 38. Nice job. Yeah. Me meaningless game for the Storm, so it wasn't a huge deal. But yeah. Uh, let's read the comments here. A new Perth, Perth team's first signing should be Wishart. What a player. Yeah. Okay. Well, it was Wishart then at the beginning against the Panthers, I'm pretty sure. Um, that high shot call around the 48 minute mark was because, yeah, that was probably the one we were just talking about. I, yeah, that was crazy. Um, Titans fan, thank God, Storm of Insane Death, the rest of 11 players, suddenly a team that plays as well as a reflection on how good coach Craig Bellamy really is, yeah. Yeah, Wishart, lots of Wishart stuff. Cowboys, 90, 90, 39 missed tackles, oh my God. What, in, what on earth constitutes a high shot if the player's almost lying down? Yeah, yeah, that, that's the thing that's like, yeah, it's kind of, uh, okay, well, lots, of, lots of comments about the high tackle as well. Yeah, that was definitely a weird one. Okay, let me look at Wishart though. That was uh, NRL. I want to don't spoil myself. Don't spoil myself. Where is Storm Panthers? Was it Wishart? That I believe it was Wishart. But let's just check. Tries no, not against the Panthers. What game was it? Uh, around twenty-five. Was it this one? Storm versus oh, was it versus the Dolphins? Let me spin this versus the Dolphins. Let's see. No, it wasn't. Who was I thinking of? Was it Wishart? Was that a few weeks ago? You guys must have been going, what the hell are you talking about, buddy, this whole time? The Rabbitohs game? No. Who the heck was I thinking of? <laughs> Let me know who, who I was thinking of this whole time. I guess it wasn't Wishart. But maybe I can, you know, from that one, I'm not spoiling myself. I'm looking. Tyron Wishart. I swear it was him, but I guess not. He must. Where's Wishart? 
Well, I guess he didn't. Who, okay, who was I thinking of then? There was someone that I watched recently that had like a bunch of really good. Was it assists? No points. Try assists? No. Okay, I don't know why I was thinking of Lishra then. Maybe he just looked good against the Panthers. I don't know. Fill me in. Fill me in. I totally forget what 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 I, what I was thinking of. Anyways, okay. Next up, we got Bulldog Seagulls. This is a really really good matchup. Uh, I believe the Bulldogs are fifth, and the Seagulls are eighth. So the Seagulls actually have to like. I mean, it'd be extremely unlucky if they lost both and then someone else got in ahead of them. But they need they definitely need to win here. Um, but the Bulldogs also the Bulldogs are looking very strong. They might be in the top four right now. Is, are they in the top four? Roosters, Roosters, Sharks, Pandas. I think are the top four the storm and then then the bulldogs yeah so the bulldogs have a lot to play for they're trying to get top four top four yeah you guys told me top four is like super important because you get like the whole uh you, you can lose twice in the finals if you get top four so that, that's like a massive advantage so they're gonna be trying their balls off seagulls are fighting to stay in um yeah i had bulldogs by four was my pick and we'll stick with that i guess because yeah the, the bulldogs are like i think they're undefeated at home right i believe so that's yeah we'll see we'll see has anyone won every game at home in a season before in the NRL? Does that be cool to see? Ooh. No way. Wow, what a start. What a start. Holy crap. I just spit over my mic. That was crazy. Right off the rip. <clears throat> Ooh, good passing. Oh, did he get that? No, I didn't knock it. No, I guess it wasn't. I thought he might have uh, knocked it on. On the... On the yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, he kicked it. Oh, what a play. No way. This game is crazy. Turbo. Guys, that was a crazy start. Good passing, nice. Yeah, Seagulls are flying. Eighteen six. Okay. Bulldogs, Bulldogs. Oh, what a tackle! I mean, what was that? Gave it away. Oh, ooh. Like, was that guy okay? Jeez. Tackling him right into his leg. Oh, what a run! Nice. Oh, is he hurt? Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not good. I mean, if he's okay, I think. Oh, no, he's still there. I still see him. I see him. Okay, he's fine. Oh, bad defending there. Okay, he got D card. Twenty four twelve. Okay, so Eagles are running away with this right now. Nice, good strip. Yeah, he stripped him. He stripped it. What a strip. Late half try. You gonna get it? Good step. Ooh, jeez, jeez. All right, they stuffed him to the line. Okay, nice. What a kick. Oh man. That was a massive that kick that the ball the ball bouncing across the whole field. Crazy. What a pass. Good step. Cheese manly. Alright, looks like I think the manly's gonna take this. So much for the Bulldogs winning every home game just now. Jeez. Oh you twelve. That's a big gap right now. There you go, Manly. Yeah, I, th I think I should have mentioned that. I, I think a Manly win also clinches them top eight, doesn't it? I believe. So this they also had something to play for, obviously. Oh, Burden with a failed HA. Okay. Oh, I missed that. Let me start again. I was looking at Burden. Oh, fuck. That guy exploded up at him. Jeez. He's thrown the kitchen sink at him. Oh, what a run. Oh, what a step. Uh, didn't, didn't have uh, no off foot available. 
Oh no, Turbo! Oh shit! Oh my god, his head's like... He's holding his arm though. He has his arm that got hurt, but his face was mangled too. Oh, huge hit! On Cherry Evans! <laughs> Cherry Evans just carries on like nothing happened. Guys, so Manley's going to take this one. Jeez. I think that clinches them in the finals. They're very close to being clinched. They try for the Bulldogs. Oh, get off on your pass. Oh, what a kick. Nice, what a kick. Good try. Alright, 34 22. Manly by 12. Yeah, huge win for the Seagulls. Yeah, 34 22. Manly by 12. So there goes my picks for the week. I needed a perfect week, I think, to even get close to the top of my uh, of our of our pool. I was looking at the comments, though. The combination of Turbos, the Brooks, the Talos, the Hot... Man, I know how to say this, but I always forget. The Hop... Hoppo... <laughs> I give up. Uh, the Homo... Jesus, man. I need to do a video. I legit need to do a video on like, how to pronounce names in your guys' areas, because these are crazy. Uh, the DCEs, the Sabs, the Garricks is just frightening. He has a lot of... Uh... It's, just, it's kind of similar in hockey, where lots of families are... Um... Lots of families play make the NHL the same. Time. Not so much like brothers as much. There's a few. There's a few sets of brothers in, in hockey, but a lot of like father sons and like cousins and stuff. Um, but yeah, uh, doggies needed that Samoan guy with the headgear at number four. <laughs> went, went a little bit quiet for the halftime at a or course save tonight. All bark, no bite. <laughs> Curtis Morin getting flat flattened in a clean hit took the HA in clear embarrassment for getting bodied. Yeah. Unfortunately, Tom is in and hope he's back in the finals. Yeah, yeah. I'm curious to see. I didn't really see what happened to his arm, but his head was bleeding, so that's not good. But um, hopefully it's not a broken arm or something. There's not too many injuries other than a broken arm that would really keep you out. But I guess there are. I don't know. I don't know why, but I feel like this loss was needed. It brings the team back to earth and gives the team some things to polish on come finals. Yeah, that, that's always good. Humble yourself a bit. Cry oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Crichton wasn't playing. I forgot about that. Crichton wasn't playing. He's like really key player for them so yeah that makes sense makes sense why they wouldn't you know they wouldn't be as strong without him you guys yeah you know, all you guys mentioned he's like you can argue he's like the best player in the league right now other than maybe clary he's just like that important to their team um okay anyways we got panthers rabbitos um yeah so i kind of unexpected the panthers are actually playing for their top four lives at the moment so they're i assume they're not going to be benching peak players they're going to have their full lineup in I forget when I did my tips if I saw the team list. I think it was mostly their starters, right? Because, they're, yeah, they're still playing for position. So, really important game for them. Um, I did pick them by 40 over the Rabbids, but just thinking now, I feel like they might actually, if they get like a lead, like a 20-point like a lead maybe, then maybe they'll put all their reserve guys in. But just to, like, not risk anything, even if they're, yeah, because they should win regardless. But anyways, let's see what happens. Panthers by 40. Friday night footy. Underway. And the Golden West. And Henry Ooh. starting the game and feels the brunt of a Kaloa Matangi bell ringer. Oh, what a dummy. That's crazy. Geez, a good player to say, yeah. Freddie. Well, it was identical last week. Fisher Harris scored a try. Following yeah, Jose, it's uh, crazy having Jose, big, uh, big guys the like that, that can dummy like that is crazy. Under the post, ground on the play. Yeah. In the days of the footy doubles, Brad, you'd walk in, you'd get number ten, you'd throw it the bin. Damien, not there. <laughs> <laughs> the way. Oh, the try score is kicking, and I tell you, it's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Did he get it? No way, he got it. What? Ooh. Nice. There you go. 
Duncan. He's lost the head gig. Dallas Duncan, a kick now by the Big kick. Oh, geez. Yeah, this is a blowout. It's a blowout. Well, that kick, had, that kick had to be absolutely perfect, and it was. Look how many That players. camera angle is awesome. He absolutely threads a needle there. Ooh. Oh, what a run. Jeez. Oh, wow. That was nasty. <laughs> Did that try not count? Wait, what? 357. Yeah, that try didn't count. Let me know what happened there. That didn't count as a try. Unless the scoreboard got bugged. Still says 18 nothing there. Oh, what a bounce. <laughs> Try August. And his teammates rush in. It's such oh. a brave effort from this young man. What happened? Great to see him get a try. Let me know what happened to that player. Looks like something happened in his personal life. It's the bird things all right with him. Not so effective. Tungle, uh, oh no, there was a hand by South Sydney. There looked to be a knock on by Tungle. Referee saw it differently. Tungle Jeez. still alive here. No one makes a tackle. What a play. Head down, running towards the line. Cut down short. Bird just tries to save it. Let him up. Six again, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Nice. Eight short of the halfway. They're not shy with the booze tonight out here at Penrith. Oh, Luai just takes it and runs. What a run. Jeez. What a pass. Nice. <laughs> oh, dude. Ooh, so nasty. Jeez. <laughs> oh, bad pass. He's gone, I think, right? Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> right. Oh, jeez, watch out. Don't hurt your teammate. <laughs> There's a... Uh... I, I always like cringe when I see guys jump on their teammates up to celebrate because there's a in the NHL there was a player that um he like skated to like jump into his teammate and hug him and he like accidentally jumped too hard and concussed his teammate. His teammate was like out for the rest of the playoffs. It was brutal. It was like one of their best players too. He just got like he got a bit excited and just like KO'd his teammate. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Or just throw, shoves that guy off him. Were they they're arguing some the interference? Fisher Harris could have got to the ball. He yeah, him that's interference. The There's no one behind the line to get it. Uh, this will be a sin. definite. James never has the ball. Keon, you tackle him. It's a professional foul. You look in. Yeah. Okay. Need, need some Panthers tries here to get my margin. During this time, they want to be putting on two or three tries. That's one for Yo. Did he get it down? I think he got it there. Yeah, he got it there. Yeah. Yeah, okay, there's one. Didn't they get another couple? Ah, damn. All right. Panthers up. What's that, 22? No. Dude, I'm so bad at math. 18. No, just 22. What am I talking about? Yeah, 22. Jesus Christ, guys. I just woke up. Apologies. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, West Tigers fans should be excited to have Luai coming over. Yeah, for sure. He's going to be awesome to watch with the Tigers. Um, hopefully they can. Uh, yeah, hopefully, like I said, hopefully they can they can gel with his play style and all that stuff. But um, yeah, it'll be awesome having him there. Hopefully, he can lead them to uh, out of the bottom of the ladder. Um, that tries this by Luai to Taruva was like the state of origin game three assist try. Luai, you're an absolute beauty. Yeah. When Luai's out, he can't be stopped. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I've, I've seen Luai do some insane stuff, but I've also seen him have like some major mistakes. Like, was that against the the storm when he had like a brutal turnover? Um, maybe not. Um, incredible strength by Terry Roan to play it himself and his family proud. Yeah. Yeah. I hope everything's okay with him. I'm assuming there must have been a death in his family or something. So, yeah. I hope they're, hope they're all doing well and all that stuff. Um, 
Oh, here we go. Can someone explain that why Brian Tuo didn't score that try? I'm assuming this is the one that I saw that didn't count. Uh, someone jumped into a Panthers play and they called an obstruction. Embarrassing to watch. Big flop, they're saying. Okay. All right. Well, that's big for the Panthers. So they should be locked in the top four for, the, for, for now. Um, we'll see if they... Yeah, I wonder where they'll finish up. See, I guess it does it does matter like that where you finish in the top four because I guess you could you could avoid playing. No, no, I guess everyone would have a chance to play each other again, right? Like, yeah, yeah. Anyways, all right, we got eels, dragons. Um, I think I have yeah the dragons. That's that's Hunt and Lomax, right? The dragons and the dolphins. Uh, I forget. I totally forget which team is which. I always mix up dragons and dolphins. They have similar colors and similar. Uh, the both like a, a water sort of creature. I guess dragons aren't really water, but they're like lizardy type things. I guess <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, but eels versus dragons. I have dragons by twelve. Uh, eels, eels are like out of it. Dragons are battling hard to to stay or make top eight. I think they're they're right in the mix. There's like four teams that are tied, right? So they're right in there. All right. They are underway. The first of three games. Right here on Super Saturday. It's Super Saturday. The catch and Molo will bring it out here. Short ball here for Ogden. All thought about reaching out. Did well. Oh, not produce a double movement. Now Brown brings Pennison. Early try for the Eels. There you go. It was pretty simple. Yeah, I, I really Eels like these Eels jerseys. Eventually the like royal the blue with the, with the gold the yellow. Out the back they go. Oh. Oof. No way, Sivo. That was nasty. That hit was. I want to watch that hit again. That was a massive hit. You could hear it on the. You could hear the noise of it. That was crazy, like Sivo. I think at the start of the season, Sivo had some sick tries, I believe, and you guys were hyping this team up to me. And Sivo was awesome to watch. There you go. Ooh. Did you get it? Nice. Given the green lights on field. That was awesome. Now, is he on this left hand side? Cut out ball there. Sivo. Yeah, Sivo's just a tank. He's got Gutherson. Two v one. Yeah, easy, easy. Jeez. Eels, come on. Let's go, Eels. Yeah, the Dragons cannot lose this. They're basically out, right? If they lose this, I think. I feel like they're a lot again, but I'm pretty sure they're like done if they. This other team's gonna win, right? So. As he works it across the Sean Lane, bump through the tackle of Jeez. That was a oh, yeah, it, it is hunted in the Lax on the Dragons. Okay. Sean Lane goes Jeez. Dragons don't want to. They don't want to be there, I guess. And now Dijon Asi who's kicking no, way, no, 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 All right, well, you can probably remove the dragons from the, from the uh, top eight of this. Holy. Here they go again. Brown off and running. Blue and golds everywhere to pass to. Man, it back to back. Inside. It is Gutherson. Two tries in two minutes. Elisa okay, there's actually... There's still three minutes left in this highlight package. Hopefully that's not a spoiler, but if the Dragons just came back from this, that would be insane. They're down 30. There's no way, right? There's Lomax. That's not a good sign. They, there's no one even near him on the Eels. The Eels think they've won this or something. Oh, f oh. Holy smokes. He got smacked in the face, too, by the... Jesus. It was missile-like. Assey, Brown, good hit. Oh, great Lane passing. Stevo. Who brought up his 100th <laughs> try of his career earlier today. He's had <laughs> another okay, one. There's no way they come back. There's no way. It must just be the Eels to score a ton more. Gutherson, flat pass. Play on at the back. Jeez, what's going on here? Still play on here for Parramatta. Off of Ngao, he cleans up. Sevo for the oh. Dude, Sevo is so good. And Micah He's has so nasty. Sivo. 44 12. There you go. 
Right, there's only 10 minutes left. There's no way. They'd have to score like literally every minute. Oh, what a pass. That, that almost looked like a forward pass, but... Oh, jeez. What are these hits, man? Look at this hit right here. Oh, my God. There's some massive hits in this game. 44-24. So only 20 points. Only 20 points. That's like, what is that? Like four tries. Alright. There's another one. It's a room service bet. A piece of sublime. All right, forty-four thirty. Dude, okay, I gotta set up for this even more. This could actually happen. There's enough time. They get this right here. They got it. Middle, middle, yeah. Dude, okay. Oh my god, thirty seconds. They'd have to score this and then score right away as well, right? No way. Oh, what a pass. Uh, I think the time's going to run out. What a kick. Jesus. He got, there's, is, there's not time though, right? Yeah, yeah, not enough time. That was wild. Holy crap. 44-40. For the Dragons, yeah, eight chances. Yeah, at full time, Parramatta 44 40. That's it's that must that's that has to be the highest score game I've seen, right? Like 84 points. That's a ton. I don't think I've seen a higher combined score. Um, let me know where that ranks all time. That must be one of the one, maybe not one of the highest, but like pretty high up there. Um, yeah, so I forget if the Dragons were the team. There's one team that had like 28, I 28 points, and the rest had 26, I think. If I have that correct, just let me know. I, yeah, if they're one of the twenty, the twenty-six point teams, then they're they're done. They're not going to make it. But if they're, if they're the twenty-eight point team, they still have a chance if they win next week. Um, anyways, comments. Uh, this is the first time in the history of the NRL that a team has scored forty points or more and lost the game. Wow. Oh, geez. Okay. Well, there you go. It's a record-breaking game right now. That's insane. That must mean that, that no one's there's hasn't been a higher combined score than right unless the team scored eighty points before. So yeah, that's wild. Only because of the ref. <laughs> Trent Barrett must have been coaching for the foul 10 minutes. I don't think I understand this joke, but I'm it's I'm assuming it's a coach that's really bad. So um a team with Paris first half offense combined with the doggy second half defense would be unstoppable. Imagine supporting either one of these teams. How would your heart even make it? Yeah. Being a Paris supporter is so rough, man. <laughs> yeah, this sounds exactly like being a Leafs fan is. But yeah, you, a lot of you guys early on compared Parramatta to the Leafs in hockey. Yeah. Um, yeah, you know, both teams are off the offensive and they manage to score 40 points to each other. Teams really don't want to qualify for this final series, do they? Yeah. Yeah, that's hilarious. Sivo, Sivo, Sivo. Yeah, Sivo's awesome. Sivo's definitely, I mean, it's hard to like love a guy that's when he's on like a bad team, but. Every time I've watched him, mean, I've not every time, but like he scores a lot of sick tries. I feel like he's, he's just an absolute tank. I'm um, all right. Dolphins Broncos. Um, this is a this is a massive matchup. I, is it the Dolphins that are in eighth? I think it's the Dolphins that were in eight, and then the Dragons, Dragons Broncos Raiders were tied. I believe in like nine, ten, eleven spot. I think, but yeah. So I picked Broncos by six. I figured it'd be funny to see the Broncos somehow sneak in to, to the eight after. Um, after a really weird season and with Walsh, I, I don't know if Walsh is out for the year, but he's he's not playing, right? So so uh it'd be funny to see them like somehow sneak in. But we'll see. It's a Dolphins home. But we'll see. It's a Dolphins home game, so yeah, they're probably the favorites here, but we'll see. Here we go. The battle for eighth position begins. It's battle, battle for eighth position. Brisbane. Battle of Brisbane. Tackles left as it comes slowly to Platt. Long for Nichols. Here's Avarillo. Now Farnworth. Farnworth holds it. Jeez, there you go. Yes. Dolphins early. The, to the, mm -hmm. Bronco. the former Bronco. That's awesome. Jermaine Uzako. Ask the decoy. 
Ooh, bad pass. Yeah, hospital pass. Did he get hit high here? Oh. What? Did he hit him? It looked like he flopped there, but I, I guess they saw it if they reviewed it. The hammer. All right. With the, with the Sinbin, they score. That's not good for the Marcos. Okay. <laughs> they got little dolphin uh, flippers. <laughs> yeah, they had his leg. There you go, Broncos. He's like some retro uniforms. These must be like 90s, 80s uniforms. The diamond checker pattern. Oh, dropped it. Uh oh. That's the hammer. He's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, watch out, watch out. You gotta keep going. That guy almost caught him. That was really close. Hammer. <laughs> the hammer. I love the hammer as well. He's awesome. Oh, fuck. That was a head. Yeah, that's a send in. That's a send in. That's maybe a, could be a send off. Okay, just a bit. That looked really bad, though. That could have been a send off. If he was, like, hurt really bad, they might have sent him off there, I think. There you go, Dolphins. Right. Okay, Dolphins are going to take us. Yeah, Broncos. Broncos don't have it in them to. It'd be too, uh, yeah. This will be the last now. From center field, it comes across O'Sullivan to Avarilla. Subtle, Farnworth, powerful. There you go. Herbie's in. Yeah. Ooh, watch out, watch out, watch out. <laughs> Oh, no way, dude. He's so good. The hammer. Man. He's nasty. It's an absolute blowout. Yeah, they, they want that top eight badly. Yeah. Yeah, massive. Kirby. <laughs> That 34. No uh, chip and chase. Ooh. All right. Dolphins by 34. It has been a dolphin domination. Redcliffe has run rampant. Yeah. There you go. Battle Brisbane. Belongs to the team from the peninsula. It's the Dolphins night. And they're still alive in 2024. Yeah. That guy's not happy. <laughs> All right, let's take the comments. Huge win for the Dolphins. How fucking good is Herbie? Yeah. Commentators, absolute best again. Yeah. Yeah, there's a couple. Yeah, I've said it before, but yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, the. Most of the commentators I enjoy, but there's a couple that really stand out to me, and this guy's definitely one of them. Um, practically confirmed whoever wins next week between Knights and Dolphins is making finals. Okay. Pressure's on Kev, just like it was with Brad Arthur. After the final high, it's going to be a big fall. Yeah. Broncos with their pants pulled down. I'm just here for the comments. Yeah. Yeah. The new Kings of Brisbane. Dolphins. Yeah. That sweeping run set played by the Hamlet. Let's see us again. Last 10 away. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Let me see it again. That, that, that reminds me of a football player where the guy comes, he comes from further behind and just sweeps across. Yeah. Last 10 away. Perfect play. Yeah. Yeah. No one's like catching him there. No one's like set up to cover him. All right. Yeah. Let's move on to the next one. So, Sharks Warriors. So, this one has implications for the top four, right? Um, some of the Sharks are just like, ran, like, I feel like, I feel like, like, I was so high on the Sharks and then they started losing. And then I feel like I kind of like forgot about them and like everyone was saying they're bad. And, but then they just they keep winning games. And now they're like, they, they could finish second in the whole freaking comp right now, right? So that's crazy. So I have Sharks by 16. I guess we'll see what happens. Uh, the Warriors, yeah, the Warriors are pretty much done. But it is Sean Johnson's second last game, right? So maybe one of these two games, they'll have a good game for him. So he gets, a, gets to go off on a win, but we'll see. Super Saturday, Super Saturday night in Cronulla. 
And the Warriors first use. Johnson on the front foot. Ooh, there you go, Johnson. What a play. What a play. Um, I wish you had to see him in his prime more. What a play, though. It's a bit of a passing of the bat. Passing of the baton, yeah. Ooh, good stab. Beautiful play, the number seven for Granella. Walton, who's only had one previous touch of the ball tonight. Nasty. Here's the Sharks' first try scorer. Last play. Trindle with it. Flat ball in round. Hey, your Sharks. And a great name in New Zealand rugby league scores against the Warriors. Okay, New Zealand guy. First one was Wilton. Scores against the Warriors, interesting. And plays the hero who is just so powerful. Nice. Four games for the final Ooh. last day of rugby league. Brayley. What a pass. Stone Street. Stone Street. Nice. Local junior. Nice. <laughs> That's awesome. So he grew up he grew up a big Sharks fan. Yeah. That'd be awesome. Jeez, yeah. Okay, blow a time. Blow a time for the Sharks. Hazelton. Is that Hines? That was Hines. He came in off the bench, looks like. Yeah. Nice. Nico. Nico, he's back. Are they calling interference? He now stops in the line. This prevents Wade Egan having a direct run and attempt. Uh, I guess. That was like a tiny... It was a tiny little pick. There for Egan. Now the right side. Johnson to a picky. On to a tenny. Zalesniak. Zalesniak. The 99th try of his career. 99 tries. Okay. For the Warriors. Jeez, okay. Still a chance with the Warriors. Metcalf little show. Johnson kicks up. Big kick. What a kick. 100. 100 for DWZ. There you go. Johnson's having a good game, at least. On the score sheet. I, obviously, these are just highlights, so I don't know if he was messing up all game, but he's had a couple of really good plays. Oh! That's a high hit, I think. He, he, he slipped, though, but... Oh jeez. Yeah, I'm not sure. That's the same as that other one. Where I don't know if you could really blame the defender, but... Uh oh uh oh Fight, fight, fight. <laughs> same thing. Okay, that's actually... Alright, if the Sharks are on the band, there's actually a chance here for the Warriors to come back. Yeah, there's one. Oh, jeez. Get it? Yeah. The Warriors have got another. The Warriors may be riding a headline here. Jeez, man. If the Sharks pull this. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, my God. No way. He's still going. That was crazy. Oh my god. Don't tell me the Sharks played Himes in when they were winning and then blew the game. There's no way, right? There's no way. I don't know if you actually know when Himes came into the game, but he was wearing 22, right? So he must have come off the reserve bench, right? There you go, Sharks. Stone Street. Stone Street will save you guys. Jeez. Johnson Magic. DWZ, did you get it? He got it. No way. No way with another Johnson assist. No way. Directed by Sean Johnson. His last game. Oh, it is his last game. There's no way. Do they have a bye next week? They must have a bye next week. Okay. That's awesome. What a career. That's crazy. You can't even write that up any better than that other than like winning the championship that's like awesome what a play what a what a player forever warrior forever kiwi and forever legend thank you sean johnson i'm so unbelievably proud to say 
I watched her entire career, enjoy retirement. Yeah. Lots of, yeah. Written, produced, directed by Sean Johnson, the movie, his last name, legendary. Yeah, that was that was a sick call. Um, I still remember watching SJ's Touch Footy Highlights in high school. Absolute legend. What a career, what a comeback, what a performance. Yeah. Damn, that's awesome. I wish I didn't, uh, I wish I knew that was his last game. I guess they, they have a bye next week, right? They must have a bye next week. So that was their last game of the season. Um, yeah, it's awesome. I'll definitely have to do, I, th- I think I did do a Sean Johnson reaction like early in my rugby league. Uh, YouTube stuff, but I'll have to do another one. Like going, I'm sure there'll be a. I'm sure some of you guys will make a crazy uh, highlight compilation, or the NRL will make a compilation of them and stuff. So I'll definitely check that out because yeah, it's obviously one of the legends of the game. Um, yeah. Anyway, so is there any comments in the actual game here? Um, I'm a Nico fan, but his defense is poor. It's the reason he will probably never play Origin again. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, that was crazy. Sean Johnson, what a game. Was that a try try assist hat trick I think he had there? And then DW, DWZ had a had a hat trick as well. Or maybe D of four? He might have had four. Um anyways, yeah. So there goes my yeah, my picks this week have been terrible. So damn. <laughs> um, all right, we got Knights, Titans. Uh I'm Knights by eight. I'm assuming I think I said in my tipping video that um like the Knights are gonna win, but the Titans score a lot, so they'll like the margin won't be that crazy, but the t- the, the Knights should just pretty easily win us, I think. But we'll see. The Knights obviously need to need to sneak into to the to the finals. So Connor gets us underway. Second last game of round number twenty six. Oh, geez, what happened there? Oh, what are game. these uniforms? I like these uniforms for the Knights a lot more than their usual ones. Here come the Knights, left and right. There we go. And they must be retro ones again as well, yeah. Oh, there's an injury there for the Titans. Oh yeah, Best is back, yeah. Best is back. The on-field decision will be supported and held up. We have a decision. What happened? Oh. Okay, I didn't see what happened there, but... There you go. Fafita. Oh, what a run, Fafita. There you go, Titans. Well, Jalen De Groot would have scored under the posts, but for Fita, unlike Bradman Best, backed himself to the corner, and they've got the first try of the Titans. As the uh, Titans go, oh, look at there. Look out. Yeah, Best. Best, picks it up. Best is fine. He's a tank. Best being chased by Titans. Jeez, yeah, there's no one else that has seemed near him. <laughs> There you, go. there you go, Knights. Oh, no. oh, was he hurt? Oh, no, no, no. I thought he was holding his back. Yeah. Oh, good offload. Good pass. Good passing. Jeez. Oh, no. <laughs> Alright, we back to back. This time, the Knights take full advantage of opportunity created. It ends up a very good try blocker. Yeah, you know what I like, but the anticipation, best perfectly timed pass, back on the inside, a little juggle, and Ponga goes in for number two. Saves his future, really. Crossland out in front. Ponga, a move, passes off the deck. All clear, Bradman Best with it. He passes Best, yeah, Best is a huge, he's huge for them. So it's, like he's, he's been out for a while too, right? Like a, since Origin almost, I think. It's big for him to be back. Is that a shoe on the ground? What is that on the ground? Over there. there you go, nice, yeah. So that's right. Uh, Jeez, that was like... <laughs> Well, maybe he back to back. Stone Street areas and score <laughs> at better than a try a game. They just can't get back, get the numbers there. Brody Jones, yeah. beautiful flick pass. We talk about the skill of these players. Look at that, out the back. The flick out the back. He can't believe it. 25 from the line, right up the line with Kroger. Ooh. A missed tackle. Now it ends up with Gagai. Kicks for Sharp. We got the Hattie, the hat trick. <laughs> Yeah, it's a natural hat trick in uh 
in uh yeah in hockey if you score three goals in a row like if it, it it's, it's called a natural hat trick um so yeah natural natural try try hat trick there for uh for fletcher are they they're just sending it to him every time it's crazy oh they, they had him that time <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he's done. No way. No way. That'd be crazy. Oh, huge. Oh, good D. Good D. Good D. Last tackle. Oh, boy. This is all one way traffic. Crossland got a high ball. Best passes back inside. Yeah. Nice. All right. Yeah. Knights are going to take this one pretty handily, it looks like. Kick to the corner. Oh, there you go. Nice. Where's Con Pereira at? I feel like I haven't heard his name once yet in this game. Oh, good steps. Oh, what a pass. That was sick. Yeah, those tests by Campbell. Is Campbell a young guy? He looks like he's a young guy. Yeah. Yeah, that was nasty. Oh, jeez. Just runs him over. <laughs> oh, jeez. That guy smacked his head on the ground, too. Jeez. All right, 36-14. Huge win for the Knights, yeah. Yes, the Knights, yes, the Knights, Dolphins, and who's the other team? That, is it Raiders, the last one here? Yeah, Raiders, the last one. So, so two of the two of the four or two of the five have won so far. Um, anyways, uh, Fletcher Sharp has got to be this underrated signing by the Knights by far. Yeah. Bring on the Dolphins, they're the best team win Knights. Yeah, okay, so look, looking like it's going to be Knights versus Dolphins makes it in the top eight, is from what I'm understanding. Yeah. Very interesting fireworks dude and Ryan. We have to look forward to folks. Yeah, bro, we have a chance. Billy picked Walsh over Ponga. <laughs> Newcastle's final destiny is in their hands. Beat the Dolphins in their end. Yeah. Up the mighty knights. <laughs> Titans right side defense is weaker than Connor McGear's ankle. It's nice. Why orange? Okay, okay, here we go. It's our NSW mining jersey. The boys wear it once every season because they're one of the sponsors. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> woke <laughs> that's why they're orange <laughs> that's funny yeah i definitely i definitely like anything's better than the, the regular night jerseys i do just do not like them at all the regular night jerseys so these ones are pretty sick i think they'd be even better if they were navy on top and then orange highlights those would be pretty sick but um yeah anyways roosters raiders um based off the comments of the other games i'd assume even if the Raiders win this they probably don't have a chance to make it right so yeah, but I had Roosters by fourteen. Um, they're going they still have most of their players playing, right? Because they're still battling for position. So we'll we'll see what happens. But yeah, Roosters by forty is my pick. I, yeah, the Raiders are. I'm assuming are done. So let's see. The Raiders with the footy. Here comes Corey Horsburgh into the starting team, sparingly used by Ricky Stewart. Now Victor Radley got him with a beauty up under the ribs. He's down and back play. Ooh, Walker okay. tries to beat them with the boot. Tedesco's there. Ooh. Again, desperation. Oh, what's happened? Uh-oh. I'm going to check up high. Uh-oh. Look out. Check oh, up high. No. Uh-oh. Well, the Roosters Premiership aspirations. That's not good. Who's this? Hobbling off the back at the northern end of Allianz Stadium. Which player was that? Sorry, I don't know the number here. Okay. Well, the Roosters to beat them with the boot. Tedesco's there. Oh, no, that's Walker. Oh, okay, that is Walker. Oh. That is not good. That is not good. Jesus, okay. Sheesh. Do they have anyone else who can fill in for him that's any good? It didn't seem like it by the sound of the commentators. But. Oh, English veteran, okay. Hey, how, how many players are there from, like, Europe that are playing in a row? I know there's some, but like, what's the actual statistics on it? I'm curious to know. Oh, the same are going to stay in the uh, the Super League is, is it was called in Europe or in, uh, in the UK. Oh, great defensive tackle, savage. Well, it's not a hip drop. It's just. 
Well, he got him over the top, but oh dear. All right. Oh Brandon geez, Smith another injury. Okay. One report in the bin. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, okay. That guy looks like Tom Hardy. Oh, it's that. Oh yeah, he, he fell on his leg and then pulled him back. Yeah. Can't nice. really argue that. Oh, what a run. Oh no, he knocked it on. Jeez. Uh -oh. Another injury? Jeez. Three Roosters players hurt? That is not what you want to see going to the finals. Oh. What the heck? Savage will win the yeah, he's gone. He's gone. He's too fast. A loose ball pounced upon by Canberra. <laughs> that was and wild. Savage. Try for Did Savage end. just hurt himself too? <laughs> Watson dancing. Offload into Crichton. Ball in one hand. Whitehead's there again. <laughs> what is going on there? Did he just kick it with his... <laughs> he's laughing. <laughs> He got a bin for that? What are you doing? <laughs> That's hilarious. He just like kicked it as a joke and they like, kicked him off. Where's Dom Young, by the way? Is he not playing or is he just not done anything yet? Oh, there he is. I see him at the bottom there. Okay. Bruce is about to come back and win this because of that bin, right? That's hilarious. No. Oh, that's a penalty, isn't it? Isn't that a penalty? Yeah, that's a penalty, though. The, the guy who wanted to catch it got hit. Yeah. May have left in the sin bin. Oh, what a run. Was there a penalty there, too? Everyone was yeah, Everyone was yelling at the interference. No try. Yeah, okay, no try. We're running out of time here. They're sprinting up still. One of, the, one of the most monumental defensive displays I think I've ever seen. Uh oh, here we go. Uh -oh. oh shit. Uh oh. Exactly <laughs> what the Raiders wanted. Exactly what the Raiders wanted. Denny Levi and Lindsay yeah. Collins. Yeah, he, they were shoved, They were like putting all their weight in his chest. Sorry, my my, ca my camera is like stuttering a bit. Looks on. like hopefully that's not too bad, but it's like flickering. Anyways, yeah, there's no way they actually. All right, all right. They actually have a chance. I didn't see that there was a penalty kick there. I missed that. So they have a chance here to tie it. It's the last tackle, though. No way. Dom Young? Dom Young? There's no one near him. No way. He's got it. He's got it. He's a bounce. Let's go. No way. They're going to hit. They have to make the kick, though. No, he missed it! No way. Damn, I guess Walker usually kicks those, I think. That sucks. What a win for the Raiders. There you go. Huge win, okay. I'll uh, so comment really quickly. Panthers, no Roosters. We may not play for the finals, but it was a great look to finish the year. Yeah. Yes, yeah, I'm pretty sure, yeah. It's, it's Knights Dolphins that are going to make it the final spot. Looks like it's pretty much confirmed. Um, this is the best game of the season. The Raiders gave all their other teams the blueprint to beating these top sides. Yeah. The refs have done their best to get the Roosters open. <laughs> the bunker, the hip crunk, the chicken wing, the crusher, the six again, all make club matches harder and harder to understand and watch. Uh, holy crap, Nuggets, some of the ref decisions were mind blowing. Like, gotta say, defending eight sets in a row was a huge. Yeah. Yeah. Panthers back in second place. Thanks, Sh Roosters and Sharks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay, let's take a look at the uh, we'll do the ladder first, and then we'll do the... Um, uh, yeah, we'll do the ladder first, and then we'll do we'll look at the draw next week um, and all that stuff. So you got Storms, Storms, yeah, Storm, Panthers, Roosters, Sharks. Yes, this is still wide open. Like, I, is there a tiebreaker? What's the tiebreaker? Yeah, I'll, I'll do the ladder picture, actually, yeah, right after this to see what happens. Um. And then, yeah, Bulldogs, even, like, these, could these teams technically make it into the top four, the Bulldogs and Cowboys, if Roosters and Sharks both lose? Roosters versus the Rabbitohs, though, is probably, Sharks versus Manly is a big one, though. Yeah. 
Yeah, interesting. I guess, yeah, what is, can I find the, um, uh, where is, let me find that really quick. NRL tiebreaker. Uh, NRL, is this the, is correct? No. Where is, why is this not like a thing I can just easily find here? Okay, I have no idea. Maybe someone let me know about how this is going to play out. But yeah, like right here we have Dolphins, Knights, Dragons, Raiders, all with 28 points. Obviously, one of these two teams is going to get to 30, but could could the Dragons... Actually, these play, these two teams play each other as well. That's crazy. But it's not possible for either of these teams to make it. I guess maybe would the would the, the margin or the point differential be the tiebreaker? That's why they have no chance, because they're so far down. I have no idea. But anyways, uh, and then what's going on with the uh, Eels Tigers? They play each other too for the, for the wooden spoon. That's crazy. Eels Tigers. Um, yes, yeah, so that's going there. Warrior, yeah, Warriors of the Bias. That was, that was their last game. And then, yeah, so we got all these teams are like, geez, yeah, who's, who's going to win all these? We got Panthers, Titans, Panthers should be the Titans. Roosters should beat the Rabbitohs, Sharks, Manly, Bulldogs, Bulldogs, Cowboys. All these teams are like playing each other. They're like close to the same. Things. Okay. That's cool. Let's do the, look at the draw as well. Hopefully we can do a stream for this last round. So we got Broncos, Storm, West Tigers, Eels, Rabbitohs, Roosters, Dragons, Raiders, Bulldogs, Cowboys, Panthers, Titans, Seagulls, Sharks. Here we go. All right. Knights, Dolphins. Okay, we're going we're gonna to do a stream for this one. Knights, Dolphins. Saturday or Sunday afternoon for you guys. We'll do, get, we'll do a stream for that one. That's obviously winner gets in, right? So that's sick. So do a stream for that. And then I guess we can take a quick peek at the stats here. Holmes should win... Pereira should win the tri leader goals. Yeah, dude, Walker. I can't believe Walker's hurt. Let me know in the comments if uh, Walker's diagnosis has been revealed yet. Because if he's gone for like four weeks, then like, geez, they're they're they're, they're like in big trouble. Um, passing the uh, all kicks, charge intercepts, tackles. Yeah, all that stuff. All right, all right. Yeah, we'll wrap that up. Uh, it's a ladder. Well, I'm gonna do the ladder predictor really quick just to see what it see what it looks like uh, for round 27. So we got Storm, yeah, Tyler. Uh, let's go with the Eels. Yeah, I think the Tigers. Yeah, the Tigers are gonna lose again. <laughs> Roosters, Rabbitohs, Dragons, Raiders. Uh, do I go? We we'll got Raiders here. Bulldogs, Cowboys, we'll Bulldogs, Panthers, Titans, Panthers. Uh, let's go Seagulls over the Sharks. Yeah. And then we'll go Dolphins. I think, yeah. You know, like the Dolphins more than Knights. So, yeah, so what does that end up being? Panthers, Roosters. So, we, we'd have Storm versus Sharks, Panthers, Roosters, round one. And then Bulldogs, Seagulls, Cowboys, Dolphins. Yeah. Yeah, they must have. The, I don't know what the actual tiebreaker is, but they must have a tiebreaker there. All right. Okay, yeah. So, now we'll just to wrap it up, we'll do the NRLW best moments round six. And then we'll look at the sat the ladder and sats and all that stuff. Um yeah, I'm gonna try to do more NRLW stuff for like when, when the finals start for NRLW. We'll, we'll check out the, that more more uh, in depth. But for now we're just gonna do best moments because yeah, it's a long video. So all right. So you got Titan Sharks up to start. This is Chapman Chapman, right? Is that the Titans? Yeah. Big tackle. Well, that's another exceptional start. She started the last set from the kickoff brilliantly to get that forward ascendancy, and Anessa Biddle caught it in the slips. This is good footy from the Sharks. And Holmes on the outside to Penatani. Holmes? She related to Valentine? Diana Penatani! Oh, you can shut the gates, it's all over. Penatani and the Sharks. You a black eye and everything. And they hit the board first. Oh. There's Ravix to Preston, and now Dodd. Tonegado. Oh, good Gado steps. Trying to thread the needle, got the pass back. He passed. Oh, the short or the Titans have their uh, Indigenous Ryan jerseys. Tank. Yeah, I think those are. They go quick tip on from Tonegado. It's on from Holmes. Penatani. Oh no way! She passed it. No way. <laughs> that was a wild uh, sequence. Tonegado. Looks like Sharks gonna take this one. Let's see though. Oh, good steps, good pass. Jeez. Big, big score. 
And that's the match winner. Yeah, let's get over. Okay, we got Eels, Dragons. Here we go. And she is gone, Tegan Berry. Tegan Berry, yeah, she's one of the best, isn't she? Brief margin. They've clicked into gear from the kickoff, it must be said. McGregor just holding the pass up. Now they find Barry. Ends up Barry again, she's yeah. Yeah, she's a freak. And in the blink of an eye, you can make it too. There you go, back to back. <laughs> in every way, speedy and skillful. She is Flash. Alright, Knights, Tigers. Than the Knights immediately yeah, yeah. shifted. Sheridan Gallagher's on the outside. There you go, big run. Sheridan from there. Nice. 10 0 Newcastle. Massive, massive danger signs for the West Tigers because the Premiers are perfect. Decent crowd in this one. Usually the crowds aren't too good, but that, that one had a pretty big crowd there. The uh, Broncos Cowboys, let's see. Is it uh, the number 15 who's out there? I thought it was Rapana, but no, it's Lafayette. And then it goes across right side now. Brigginshaw got it to Maddock. Maddock got it to Rami Tytsel. Oh, oh, good dummies. Tytsel, the girl from Tully nice. scores. A beautiful individual try, Roo, out of absolutely nothing. Manzelman again, then to Dib, and then they go down the left side trying to keep oh, back in the field. Oh, the middle. She's gone right through. Whitman. No way. She keeps it alive. She's still going. Ankle. Oh, what an ankle tap. Oh, she's still going, though. She's still going. Wow, what a try. That's a great individual. That was nasty. Out of absolutely nothing, Rue. I'm loving her, this. Yeah, her head was like Rue over her eyes. The end of it. Sends it to Maddox. Maddox to Brigginshaw. Brigginshaw has got Sazolka. Brigginshaw. Sazolka. Sazolka. She's got nice, support nice. back inside. It comes. Jeez. Good play. Stacey Walker. And the Broncos Stacey Walker. first in the second half. Yeah, let's see a blow for the cat from the Broncos here. To get it onto Hafanga now, Julia Robinson finally into space. Julia Robinson steps inside, gets she the passed, pass back passed. to Maddox. Maddox away over the twenty. They're not going to catch yeah, her. Yeah, should have that one. Nice, very, yeah, very huge well blow in game for the Broncos. And that brings them up to 38-12 with a kick to come, Roo. Mm -hmm. yeah, Roosters, Raiders, ref a rip here. Oh, good pass, rev the middle. Big step. Nice. What a play. Wow. <laughs> well, she's my favorite player in women's rugby league and has been ever since day one. Oh, wow. Okay. What was her name? Samaima. Samaima? Wow. Since day one. that comes to your favorite player, I guess I should remember that name then. Must be a really good player. Uh oh, uh oh, yeah, Aiken's gone. Aiken's really good too. <laughs> Crazy, tiring the field. All right, that right, wraps that up. Some some good stuff there. Um, let's take a good or any comments. No, usually not many comments on these videos, unfortunately. Let me see if there's any actually on the other uh the roundup. No, not too many views for the roundup, more so the highlights. Um, okay, let's look at the NRLW ladder now. Women's premiership around six. We got sharks are still undefeated. Geez, okay, that is crazy. Um, Broncos four and two, bunch of four and twos, Broncos and Roosters, Tigers are still to oh and six. It's funny how the, they're like the worst in both. Is that like a? Is there just not much money in the West Tigers org or something? Because it's crazy that the, the women's team is also like the worst team, like by far. If they have fifty-eight points in six games, that's crazy. Like they get like one try a game max. Holy smokes! Um, can we get stats for NRLW as well? See if there's any anyone standing out like crazy right now. Um, no, it's pretty, pretty, yeah. Aiken has double the line engaged. I'm not actually sure what that means, but the, she's dominating it, I guess. Um, what's my damage is pretty good there. Uh, tackle breaks, half breaks. Kick meters, all kicks. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Okay, we will wrap it up. This is a long one. I'll try to edit this down a bit more for you guys because it's pretty long, but yeah. 
All right. All right. So yeah, that was our round 26 uh, reaction. Um, make sure to tune in next week. Well, I'm going to most likely doing the uh, Dolphins Knights game because that's yeah, it's the most important game of the uh, of this final week here. So that, that'd be awesome to see. Um, yeah, I guess yeah. Once again, thanks a lot for all the support, you guys. We are at we hit 3,000 subs a few days ago, which is awesome. I was opening it to that before final started, so we uh, like goal goal achieved, I guess. Um, yeah, so we will do um, yeah, Dolphin Knights, like I said. Um, we're gonna try to do as many streams for finals as possible. I'm gonna see if I can do some double header games because I'm assuming some of the games are like played on the same day, like back to back, maybe. Um, I actually haven't looked at the. the, the the schedule for finals but i assume it's like that right uh, yeah they probably want to have like a double header just for the tv ratings and stuff um yeah yeah wrap up there thanks for watching <laughs>